This is 15 pound line and this is 20 pound fluorocarbon leader. So you need to learn how to tie a knot that is going to be strong. Um, you want small knots, but you some, want something that's going to hold up when a fish is pulling really hard on it, um, when you've snagged an obstruction, or whatever. Whatever knot you learn, you want it to be a good, strong one. Um, I have one that's very simple. Um, it's a combination of a, a simple clinch knot and a full clinch knot. Simple clinch on the, on the fluorocarbon leader side, full clinch on the braided line. Um, it's a combination of two common knots. Um, some of my friends call this the kneel knot. You start out with the leader line sign side first. And I call this first part, making a fish. See how that's shaped kind of like a whale. And I basically, I have the, the tag end of the leader line sticking right out there between my thumb and forefinger. So now what I do, I take my finger on the other hand and I have some tension going the other way. And I'm gonna twist it four times. One, two, three, four. And then I grab that tag end, and then I pull it down to right about there. This knot is halfway done now. So now that you've done that, you take your main line, and you get the tag end, and you feed it through that first hole. Now the trick to tying this knot is having the tag end sticking out here, and then if you can, hold it limply. And I like doing that by having the line down around my pinky finger, and then the other end of the line between my thumb and forefinger on my opposite hand. Now to finish this knot, that first tag end on the, on the leader line, I start spinning it slowly. That should leave you a nice big hole to go through on this side. 